Hello everyone, welcome back to Techie Pocket, and this build is what I'm calling the Muncher. This build is a $7,000 build. By the way, you can get a monitor for that price if you didn't know. Anyways, this is a $7,000 build. This is what I build for $7,000. Of course, for $7,000, why wouldn't you go with it? The 6950X top of the line Core i7 Intel has currently made. Raging Triton, because... Raging Tech Triton, I meant. Blue, because it's blue, that's why. It's my favorite cooler. Asus X99A2, because it has good ports. Very efficient motherboard, and... Efficient? That's wrong. Anyways, it's a very good motherboard, and I just like it overall. Corsair Vengeance LPX, because that's one of my favorite, uh... RAM types. 128 gigabytes, 2133 megahertz, DDR4, very good. A Intel 600 series, 600p series M.2 one terabyte SSD. I'm going to be using that for the boot drive. Then this, well, not totally. I'd say boot drive and every other program. This will be for like when I'm editing videos and I'm rendering, uploading. I'll use this to do speed, and this will be for permanent storage. Then of course two Titan XPs, $1,200 each, and the NZXT S340. I know that's not the best case, but that's a case I like. Then I went with 1000 for... I don't know, how much does this take? I don't know how much it takes, but for some reason I went with 1000 because Platinum Certified Fully Modular and enough for upgradeability. In total, this came out to be $650... $600...563 in total of the $7000 budget. So, this is just a thing to think about. If any of you want to follow this, I, this is a good build. So if any of you are looking for a $7,000 build, this would be what I'd say you should build. Anyways, catch you guys in the next video. Bye.